Welcome to the Talking Diaries podcast featuring Dr. Louis Coster with John Kramer. You actually said in your diary there's a longing to be boundless. The awareness of what limits me to be boundless makes me more present. And I think that that's part of what you're saying, because you later say the thinking creates a sense of self in the illusion of being. The moment there's a sense of self as part of the illusion, there is a response to the mind that creates a separate self. And then you said, you know, that this, uh, the mental activities are responsible to that sense of self that arises in the thinking. But in truth, I can't interact with being because I am being. Yes, yes. So, 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 <laughs> um, well, you bring a lot to the conversation, which is great. So, so you could say that, 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 um, that in our waking state, we have this sense of being or this sense of self that is created by the thinking it gives a a sense of self that actually that is not real and yet that's what we wake up with in the morning that is that is um and and most of the thinking like the mental processes that we are engaged in are like a response to that sense of self that that arises in the thinking and our response to the sense of self that appears in our consciousness is what gives this experience of a separate self. And that's where, where the conflict is, that's where the duality of experience unfolds itself. And that is what, what, what mostly occupies our day, how, how we go about life. And, and, uh, it is an illusion. Thank you for listening to the Talking Diaries podcast featuring Dr. Louis Coster. For more information, check out louiscoster.com forward slash Talking Diaries and subscribe to the Talking Diaries YouTube channel. Also, check out louiscoster.com forward slash quiz and take the free quiz to discover more about yourself.